Battling on my sex. Oh my god! Whoa! What the? No, 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 no. Back in the raft, back in the raft. What are you doing? Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to another episode of Stranded Deep. We are here. We're still stuck in a survival situation. We are starting right where we left off from the last episode. We, we made our bed. We've got the campfire. And, uh, you know, we have a small little gathering of coconuts and taters. Uh, it's, it's a great start to a survival situation. Honestly, this isn't really a bad survival situation when you think about it. We, uh, we kind of have it made out here. So here's what I want to do. I think the first thing we want to do, let's get this fire upgraded. I, I call this is like the lazy man's fire. I'd like to get a fire pit and then potentially a fire spit. Uh, but let's see here. What we're going to need, I think, is to get a fire pit, we're going to need six rocks and the campfire. And that will upgrade us to the fire pit. So we've got, let's see, one, two, three rocks. Let's go ahead and drop these. We'll just put these right next to the old campfire. Uh, uh, uh. Let's get rid of some of this stuff. Uh, one thing I saw some other players doing, which I think I will do, is dropping the paddle in the raft itself. Uh, you know, inventory space in this game is so precious. Which kind of makes sense, you know? Like, in a survival situation, unless you somehow magically found, like, a really great backpack or happen to have one on you, I really don't know what you would do as far as holding a lot of items. I don't, I don't think you could. So let's take a look here. It is 7.55 a.m. in the morning. 77 degrees. We're, we're doing all right as far as body temperature goes. Oh, here's a stick I missed. Now, I know when we ended that last episode, I think I had partially chopped a tree down. So I definitely want to go back and finish chopping that tree. I don't want to leave any, any resources behind. They're so valuable. You know, we don't want to leave any. And it looks like our little yucca plants are all starting to grow back. I know there's one over there. We got one here. This is actually not a bad island. I mean, we got three yucca plants. I wonder how many days it takes for those yucca plants to, to regrow so you could uh, get the lashings again. Oh, here's that tree right here. It's just right in front of me, right next to the old crab hole. <laughs> yeah, it's the worst. All right, let's get some lashings. Uh, Here we go. And one and two. And give me some tasty palm fronds. Please? There we are. Let's get these babies. So I'm guessing every palm tree just gives you four. I wonder if you can get more. That was kind of a tiny palm tree that we had there. We'll put the palm fronds just a little bit further away. We'll put them, we'll put them right here. This is beautiful. Best. You know, if this really was like truly a survival situation, on it, like the first thing you'd want to do is build a shelter. Like we we've kind of relegated that to the last thing that we're going to be doing. And I, I think that it's like totally opposite, you know, you definitely want, you want some sort of shelter first, unless it's truly like a tropical paradise, you know, like 80 degrees with a nice breeze, doesn't get too hot during the day, doesn't get too cold at night, I don't know any place like that, but, you know, I mean, I feel like you could probably survive a pretty good amount of time in a situation like that. Okay, so we need rocks. Oh, we need all sorts of stuff. Oh, uh, found one. I thought for sure this island was totally out of rocks, but there we go. We got one. I searched all over. I've, I've spent about five minutes just, just running around. I love how objects float. Obviously, our player character is not rendered. In fact, our player may only consist of these arms. You know, like if we could get a, uh, a third person view, I'd be impressed if we actually had a player model, a player character. Kind of hard to see. I, I just need, let's see, this will put us up at four rocks. Oh, another crab hole. Look right here. This, this little island is great. It is abundant in crabs. Oh, look at all of them. Hang on a second. We got to get some of these. All right, one sec. I'll take you. I'll take you. Oh, you are all going to be so delish. I can't grab that one. Shoot. Oh, I got it. All right. Let's put them over here with our uh, coconuts and whatnot. <laughs> I feel so bad. We just went and murdered some crabs. <laughs> crab crab battle oh crab battle all right i don't think we have any more rocks let's go ahead and throw this over by the fire that we have <gasps> where's my campfire why are my rocks amazingly stacked up like that oh okay okay so do you have to like re refuel the campfire somehow no no no, no. rock get back in my inventory let's find out 
Hmm, I saw it turn into a thing. For whoa, 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 what's happening? Maybe one more? Uh-oh. Hmm, how do you get more stuff in a campfire? Like, how do you rekindle? Okay, I'm going to try a little bit more here, and then if I can't figure it out... Okay, well, we'll figure that out in a little bit. I'm sure I could figure that out. Uh, for now, though, let's go ahead and drop the rocks. We got four. We need two more. And I saw the perfect island that we can go to. It's actually... Uh, it is northwest. And that's where we're going to go. I almost wonder if I can just swim over there. So let's, let's go ahead and empty out our inventory a bit here. Stuff we don't really need. Uh, I'm not going to bring the water. So, I guess I'll just throw that down. I feel kind of bad throwing this stuff down. Uh-uh. Two compasses. I'm going to throw this knife down. All I want. I don't even want the lighter. Please don't let me forget that. Oh my gosh. Great. Alright, let's get into our raft here. It's time to go explore it, my friends. Here we go. <laughs> Whee! So, there's an island right over there. And that's the one that we're going to head to. Let me see if I can get out a little bit here. Come on. Let's get up towards the front. Feels more magical. I saw a bunch of videos. I think it's fixed now, but I, I saw a lot of people using some glitch, like tree flying. I don't know if you've seen that, but like, you knock down a tree, and you essentially stand on it and then go to pick it up. And like in the process of picking it up, it actually lifts your character up, and you sort of start flying. Uh, I don't want to use a glitch like that. Oh, look. Okay, so there's bubbles right here. I believe... If I am to be correct, bubbles indicate there's something down there. Now, don't forget, I uh, I don't really have a knife or anything, although I don't see any sharks. So, so let's do it. Alright, let's look around here. Any shark? Oh, look at that turtle! I've got to catch that turtle. <laughs> Gotta catch him all, yeah! Toolbox, what do we got? What do we got? Oh, baby, we got a torch. Press R to use... <gasps> oh, this is magical! Look at this! I can see! Alright, hang on, we gotta go... Oh, I don't have a knife, though. But I do have my crude axe. Alright, where's that turtle? Where are you, turtle? Come on, bro! There he is. I want a turtle. A Donatellus? <laughs> can we kill turtles? <laughs> Okay, I think we're doing something to him. Oh, oh my god. Are you okay? He went straight down. Alright, we're gonna go down there. This is all for science right now. Like, remember in the first episode, I did mention that we needed a companion. Oh, I can pick him up. Let's do it. Please don't drown. Look at him. <laughs> Look at the turtle. The Donatellus Cleta, Cletopatria, or whatever. I think I might still have him. Let's make sure. There he is! Yes! Where's my raft? Alright, it's right there. You know what? We'll just throw him in the raft for now. We're gonna have just a whole gang of friends. Now, okay, I'm gonna have to be absolutely certain. One, can I get up in the raft with a turtle in my hand? No. Oh, no, no. Okay, here's what we'll do. I'll go and drop the turtle off, and then we'll be back. This is going to be a perfect spot for Carl the Turtle. That's what I've decided to name him. This is going to be Carl. We're going to call this Carl Rock. Look at this. Oh, Donatellus Chelonia. Or AKA Carl. Look at him. He's, he's gently waving his little arms. Oh my gosh. All right, that's Carl Rock. This is how we're going to know it's our place here on Coconut Island. Carl Rock is what you would call one of the historic... Uh, monuments you can go to look at them it is amazing oh my god where did my raft oh whoo thought the raft was gone that that would be terrible all right so I'll, I'll swim back out to the raft and then we're gonna head over to that island see what we can see hopefully some good stuff i don't want to be i don't want to go over there and just have nothing i mean if anything we could get some coconuts you know and some some sticks be pretty sweet battling on my sexy oh my god whoa what the? No, 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 Back in the raft, back in the raft. What are you doing? <gasps> okay, I am freaking out. Get in the raft. What is that, like a tiger shark? Oh my gosh, right when I started singing a song. Paddling along in my raft. Dude, get away. 
Is this like the first shark we might may have seen, I think, in this series? Please, please get over there. Go away. Dude, it is on like you don't even know. <laughs> Come back here. <laughs> I bet he was pissed about Carl. That's what I'm thinking. Carl was probably that shark's best friend. Oh, I am going to get you. Well, you ain't got nothing. Oh, I nailed him. I saw it. I felt it. I wonder how many swings. Can, can you even kill a shark? Oh, here he is. Hey, hey, my friend, dude, let me, I want to show you my axe, uh, in your face hole. <laughs> Come back here. Yes. I should probably remember to take a breath. Oh yeah. What do you think about that? We got, looks like a lot of stuff over here. Stay away from my raft. I definitely saw a sea wreck or whatever, a shipwreck, a sea wreck. Yeah, you know, the ocean just pulled up on that island and wrecked itself hard. But now we don't want to go too far. It, it looks like he might actually be a friendly shark. All right, let's hop in this boat right here. Can we get, can we, please let me up on the boat. All right. No telling what could be in here. Man, come on. Good stuff. This is great. All right, locker. What do we got? Another paddle. I'll take it. A morphine. Okay. We are, oh, we are wigging out. All right, one, one sec. Uh, console. What do we got? An engine. I, wow, my character is really going crazy here. Another console. Two engines. What am I going to do with two engines? I, I Hey, at least they stack. And so do the paddles. That's good. No complaints there. When in doubt, you know. I don't know how engines act, uh, precisely stack, but we'll go with it. Okay, uh, a number one priority is uh, resources, rocks and sticks. In fact, uh, let me get the raft. Let's go ahead and pull the raft back to shore here. Hmm, why did my watch just beep? What does that mean? Oh, I am hungry. Oh, my God. <gasps> oh, man. All right, so first course of action. Let's go get some coconuts. Now, I heard... I mean, I don't think you could solely survive on coconuts. You know, you could certainly, you know, drink the milk and, uh, you know, eat the meat inside the coconut, but I think you would probably get sick after a while. All right, uh, we need some coconuts here. Coconuts. Those are those round things, right? Wherefore art thou? I see some coconuts up there. Look, I see, but I can't get them. Because I can't climb trees. Oh, wait a minute. I don't need to climb a tree. Psh. We'll just chop it down. Kind of forgot about that. All right. Let's just watch this baby fall. There it goes. Oh! Coconuts. 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 Come back. You delicious little beasts, you. All right. Let's drop the... We'll drop the coconuts right here. Uh, I heard you can, like, smash them against each other somehow. Oh, it is nighttime torch out all right well let's let's deal with our coconut situation first coconut swing in chop all day long we just got to get a couple holes in the coke okay so it's drinkable so we'll do that first okay can we drink it again how are we doing okay we got a little bit from that unfortunately it's so dark now let's get some coconut meat <laughs> And I see a rock. I see a rock right in front of us. Let's see. How much did that give us as far as food? Oh, wow. Really? Barely any. Okay. Well, that's that's what it is, I guess. I mean, that's uh, how the game goes sometimes. You don't always, you know, get your fill from a coconut. That explains everything. So we will really have to make our way back. And I will definitely have to deal with this food and water. In fact, let's just go ahead and do one more coconut here. I, I read you can, like, throw the coconut. I don't even know how to throw. What in the world? I was going to say, I think you can actually smash the coconuts and the rocks, like, against uh, other items, like trees, to kind of do the same thing as swinging, like I'm doing here. Okay, so let's drink this. There's no more to drink. All right, water, okay, <clears throat> liquid's doing good. We're good there. Now we just gotta 
eat this last one. I'm hoping four coconut slices will be enough. If not, my gosh. Like, our character's gonna have mad diarrhea the next day. All right, well, hey, that's good enough. All right, ladies and gentlemen, we'll stop this episode here so we don't run too long. Uh, what I'll probably do is just go ahead and collect a few rocks and a few sticks and, and, and just look around the island. And then th that's where we'll start the next episode. I'll wait till daytime. And then that's where we will kick off. So, of course, ladies and gentlemen, if you've enjoyed the episode, definitely give it a thumbs up. Now, I will be gauging interest uh, on, a, on a daily basis, essentially with the episodes. And, you know, once interest sort of drops off, uh, then that's sort of where we will stop the series. So if you definitely want to see it keep going, you know, give it a thumbs up. Uh, you know, feel free to comment and chat and whatnot. I love that kind of thing. So until then, ladies and gentlemen, look forward to seeing the next episode. Hope you all have a great one. Take it easy and stay classy. I can't wait to go back to Carl. My little turtle, he's so far. He's up on that rock looking super sexy.